guys, it's Joe, and we're talking about dancer nutrition. And today specifically, we're gonna talk about specific herbs that dancers can take that will nourish their body, especially when preparing for a performance or getting ready for a dance battle. The first herb that I like to discuss is rhodiola. And rhodiola is great because it nourishes the adrenal glands. We all know that that feeling when our heart is pumping and that burst of adrenaline happens when we're on stage, so that we don't deplete those glands, rhodiola will nourish us in that way. The next herb that I would highly recommend for all dancers is maca. And maca is just an overall energy booster. Um, it's just a great herb in general. Research more about it. it has some interesting effects there. Corella and spirulina are also amazing because you know these come from the sea. They come from seaweed and they're great. They have all sorts of little micronutrients that aid the body and kind of give us that overall vitality um, that we may not have if we don't live next to the sea or if we don't have sushi or kelp in our diet. Um, the final herb that I would definitely recommend for dancers for everyday use is Moringa. Now Moringa is an energy stabilizer. It has so many nutrients, it has protein in it, it's actually a gentle detox in addition. Um, dancers should be taking this every day. Um, keeping your gut nice and clean and free of toxins, it also clears the, helps to clear the mind. You know those times in the day where um, some people might have an energy slump and this is when people resort to things like coffee or different types of sodas or sugar to give them that energy boost. Taking Moringa daily can help to stabilize the energy so instead of having that slump at around 2 or 4 o'clock in the afternoon, your energy is stabilized and that allows you to continue to be the best that you can be. Now remember, being a dancer is about being your best self first, being the best human you can be first. And that comes with a healthy diet, nutrition, and also the help and support of herbs like I've mentioned today. So today you've heard a lot about which specific herbs you can use to increase your performance, um, your ability to sustain your energy, and to even help to increase the longevity of your dance career. Now dancers, you've heard what I had to say today. If you need any advice or you'd like to hear more, just reach out to me and I'll answer your messages. So have a great day. Dance is life.